is there some Texans drama stewing inside NRG? <laughs> Welcome back to a brand new episode of The League. Your host is always Harley Dugan. Long time no see. Let me talk to you. The Houston Texans and cornerback Steven Nelson. Seems like there is some drama. And I put that in air quotes because I don't really care about Steven Nelson. No offense to him. I appreciate everything he did for me last year. That was with Lovey Smith. And now you got yourself a new scheme. Uh, you know, some new players have come along. Shaq Griffin was, I thought, a really solid signing for this team. Uh, Steven Nelson posted really good numbers again. Um, and to me, somewhat outplayed his contract or maybe surprisingly played out of that contract that he had. Yeah, I'm all for guys getting their money. But, and the drama is what presents itself, quote-unquote, what is up with throwing the shade at the Texans organization? What is up with throwing the shade at Nick Casario? Talking about only clowns wear this every week and, and being the, the little, the vests, you know? That's Nick Casario's look, you know? It's like someone throwing shade at me with the Texans Hawaiian shirt, you know? I mean, you could get this at FOCO, by the way, FOCO.com. Houston Texans definitely have something brewing now with Steven Nelson. Where then he also commented on a Damian Pierce picture with Hannah McNair. And that is kind of a cringy picture, if you ask me. It's a little weird. So I think he got a little, he got a little chew to the bone on that one. Steven Nelson has been known for antics similar to this. Now we could go all the way back to the Pittsburgh Steelers times. And where he had tweeted out about basically asking for his release. And you fast forward it again, and he implied that Texans need to get on with it with the news. You know, implied that it was the Texans. Didn't say it. Didn't tweet out the team word for word. But did mention in implications that maybe he, that he needs to be released. You know, and the Houston Texans, let's think about it. Look, Steven Nelson, if you are going to try to weasel and you know, be a jackass and be a dumbass and get your way out of this organization, a new organizational structure that uh, is completely different than the previous regime. And you think you can just do this ass hat backwards kind of way of getting off the team. You got something different for you, buddy. This team don't give a damn about you. All right. This guy trying to talk about that, you know, we're no Super Bowl team. No crap, we're no Super Bowl team. Damn it, we love to be hyped and excited and get ecstatic about it in the hopes of it. But we all know at the end of the team day, you know, this team ain't no Super Bowl team. We don't need no Steven Nelson. He ain't going to make or break my season. He could be gone tomorrow and I ain't even going to remember who the hell he was. All right, Steven Nelson is just another guy. A-G, A-J, A-G, I can't spell. A-J, A-G. A jab. Just another guy. He's an average corner. Had some good cornerback play. That is scarce in this league. And I do, you know, you do got to have good cornerback play, especially in today's NFL. We all know this. This isn't new news. But if you're going to throw the shade, you could get on out, man. As always, guys, go Astros, go Rockets, go Texans. Y'all have a blessed day.